Queen's Gambit declined, modern, knight defense, 5.e3c66.nf3. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. The middle game battle was fairly even. Opening with the queen's pawn. The move d5 establishes control over the e4 square, frees up the light squared bishop, and builds a presence in the center. A wing pawn is available in the queen's gambit to attack the center and divert black's attention away from the e4 square. The d5 pawn is supported by c6 in the Slav defense. The d4 pawn is safeguarded and under control thanks to nf3. nf6 controls the e4 square, advances the knight toward the center, and strengthens the d5 pawn. nc3 attacks the d5 square and starts to fight for the e4 square. The d5 pawn is supported by e6 and the bishop on the dark squares can advance. bg5 ignores the attack on the c4 pawn and develops the bishop, pinning the knight on f6. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. This defends the attacked pawn. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. The bishop is now in a secure position. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is the last book move. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. That's good. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is good. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. It is ideal. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This misses an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a chance to expose an assault on a bishop. It is incorrect. That's a decent move. That's good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This forces doubled pawns in front of the opponent's king, decreasing its safety and harming the pawn structure. It is good. Backs off. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. It's alright. That's good. That's a decent move. That's good. This attacks a knight and gains a tempo when the knight retreats. It is quite good. This overlooks a better way to defend a knight that was under attack. This permits the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. From a prior move, recaptures. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This protects the attacked pawn. This threatens to win material. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is a mistake. This misses a chance to obtain a winning position. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a queen. 
it is a miss. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. It's all right. That's good. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is a mistake. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This ignores an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is a miss. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. By moving it to the 7th rank, the adversary can activate a rook. It is incorrect. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This overlooks an opportunity to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a pawn. It is a great move. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to kick a knight. It is a mistake. This threatens to fork pieces. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is a miss. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. Thus, a bishop is attached to the king. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is ideal. Although the game was almost evenly balanced, white now holds the advantage. It is incorrect. This threatens to double the pawns in front of the king. This missed a move that would have produced a winning position. This ignores an opportunity to defend a rook that was under attack. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This misses an opportunity to capture a free pawn. This permits the opponent to unpin a bishop, allowing it to provide defense. It is a miss. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Black now enjoys a winning advantage as a result of this taking advantage of a mistake. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This let the adversary to threaten a knight and win a tempo. It is incorrect. Thus, a knight is lost. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is incorrect. This ignores an improved strategy for luring a knight. It is incorrect. This protects a knight who was being attacked and lacked defense. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is good. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. The middle game battle was fairly even. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a knight. It is a mistake. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. The middle game battle was fairly even.